poppin' homies, it's your boy Frank Nitty Back in the building, back in this car About to head to Orlando Today we're gonna take our talents to Orlando See what's poppin' the outlet, of course And pick up my son, take him to the park I think I might take him on a train ride Like I did my elder son I may do that, if we have time But it be getting packed on that train though, man If you guys from Orlando, you already know about the city transit system they got They got this sun rail that everybody used to commute to work Doesn't take you very far, but why not why not get on that but anyways man i think i'm probably gonna hit by two three outlets max i promise you guys that at least so stay tuned all right follow me about it but uh i'm not really sure right now and not really just just like he was in my shoes I, I had a ton of people just pulled up to the first nike outlet of the day i'm doing this out of order like i said i'm in town I'm gonna grab my son so i probably like i said visit three nike outlet right now we at nike outlet lake buena vista about going inside see what's popping i haven't been here in a while it looks like they take military discount man so they do advertise that up front see they take uh military discounts just fyi yo they got these croc jordan ones showing up they got these Crocs Jordan ones man the brown joints size eight and a half the only size though hitting for 300 I do have these in the collection though but the only one here if you guys want them and y'all's got these platinum fives as well all leather everything I think they hit for 300 nope 249 only size as well do got the LeBron's for 130 I like these like this colorway rather. I also like this colorway as well. This is also, this is heading for like 140 though. Fruity Pebble looking shoe. Multiple sizes. They got a pearlized one right here for 140. What you guys think about this LeBron line, man? These 15s, are they comfortable? Do you, do you guys hoop in them? They also got this low, salt and pepper low for 120. It's not a bad colorway either. Then you got this all black joint for 109. Another LeBron 15 low. Yo, this, every time I look at this shoe, it reminds me of the Michael Vitt, yo. It's supposed to be a soldier low. I don't even know, is this mid cut? Who knows, man, $100. Then you got the suede joint for hitting for 100. Multiple straps, all these straps, bro, kills it for me. <laughs> the Kobe's, the Kobe's. <laughs> so I got the rug racks on today. Air Max 98. Yo, I swear these Victor Cruz went back in price. Went up in price, man. $100 though. Yes, sir. Thank you, boys. Got these Hirachis, man. This is like a bone colorway. It's more of a brown with the, the gold plastic Hirachi symbol. Both $90. Man, who's rocking this though, man? Who is rocking this all purple, borny looking? Air Force 107 high. Saving dollars if you care for it. These are hitting for 50. This hot pink looking Air Max 107 LV8 UV. Like like in UV rays. This is definitely club the man. This is straight rainy weather type shoe, but the color is horrible. $50 if you care for it. Air Max LD Zeros, another bone looking colorway shoe with the sway hits on the back. Hundred dollars if you care for them. We can take a quick look at the hash ball before we flex. We're gonna start with the low sizes. From what I'm gathering, I am seeing a lot of Air Force One foam posit cups. These things has these things are going for 119. Air Force Utilities or Air Force One Miss, $55. I mean the colors are dope, but the shoe is ugly though, man. $70. I actually like these, man. Zoom Fly SPs. $75 if you care for them. Oh, they got some Pippins Flex. Ugly shoe. Uh, 109, wow. So I'm cheap for fire. Barclays 180s, another ugly looking colorway, $99. Price is horrible too. That always happens. I'm gonna get it later though. And you got some Cortez, yep, classic Cortez nylon, $41. Yo, Cortez was my first actual pair of Nikes, man. I had an all maroon joint, all leather back in New York before I moved to Florida. That was the first Nike shoe my mom bought. All right, I guess I picked these up. As far as the kids, man, I see a lot of Jordan ones, man. But these are hitting for $100 though. Yup. A lot of Jordan ones. This is the Kiss hash wall. This colorway don't look too bad. It's big though. Another Jordan one. What they going for? Hundred dollars. Car pack. There's really not much for Jordans, man. You do got these two deconstructs for one thirty. That's pretty much it. And these Y not zeros. Oh, and these Y not zeros for eighty. That's pretty much it, man. Unless you want to include these six rings. 
130. Yo, these are even going more than retro shoes, bro. Our pass. We're in the women's right now, man. You got these Air Force One high UT for $50. But yo, look what I also saw. These joints, these 97, size nine. They're going for 114, man. Not a bad price. It's chilling right here. And you also got another 90. This is 98. I don't know. What, what's this? Lavender? I'm not sure if the camera's picking it up, man, but that look like a lavender color. But yeah, man, 114, man. Not bad. Looking shoe nor a bad price. For women, if y'all care for them. More Air Max 98s. It's hitting for 109. These are women. Multiple sizes. Here's that lavender color away for 109 as well. Multiple sizes. I actually like this shoe right here, man. Vendel High LX. $85. This is women's. That is pretty dope. I like the whole style of the shoe. Bone colorway with a splatter of uh, navy blue and green. $75, man. This shoe is so light. Multiple sizes. All right, so I'm leaving the Nike outlet store on Lake Buena Vista. Yo, it was all right in there. I had a few old school shoes, like those uh, Croc 1s. Some things dropped like, what, three years ago, bro? Got them there for like two something, 2 dollars I believe. They also had the Metallic 5, the all platinum joints, the all leather, the one that dropped for 400 and nobody cop. They only had one size, though. That was hit for 249 the Other stuff here and there, the ladies had a whole bunch of 97s and 98. But nothing really worth copping. No Jordans, really. Down the aisles, there really wasn't much popping, man. But anyways, man, we about to go to the Nike clearance store in Kissimmee and see what's popping. That going to be the second store we visit. All right? See y'all in a bit. Peace.